when I take a photo that I like, I want to frame it. I want to put it in a frame size. The problem is, how do I print it so that it fits my frame? Well, let's take a look at this tutorial. I'm using the crop tool, specifically how to crop two frame sizes. So here we see this picture of the Golden Gate Bridge. I'm going to activate my crop tool over here in the tools palette. What I'm going to do is I'm going to come up to the crop options up to the top. I'm going to click on the little drop down, and voila, there you see it. All the different frame sizes. So I want, in this case, to crop for a 5 by 7 inch frame. I'm going to double click that, come down to this area, I'm going to drag on a crop. And whenever I move that around, that's going to be a 5 by 7 crop. If I make it smaller, it doesn't matter. 5 by 7. If I make it larger, it doesn't matter. 5 by 7. Let me go ahead and prove this to you. I'm going to hit my enter key and there you see it. It's huge. I'm going to double click my hand tool down here so it fits to my project window. Now if I click on file, print, what you're going to see is a 5x7 print. I'm going to cancel out of that. This time I'm going to edit that change. So I edited the crop. I'm going to zoom in a little bit by holding down my alt key and scrolling with my middle mouse button. So I undid the crop, and this time I'm going to click on the crop tool again and just choose, oh, a section right over here, a small section. And I think I'll go ahead and move it this direction. Once I hit enter, choose File, Print, you're going to see the exact same size, 5 by 7. So it doesn't matter what size you make the crop, it's going to be a 5 by 7 crop. I just double click my hand tool to fit my project to my window screen again. I'm going to step backwards one more time. Edit, step backwards. So I undid my crop. I'm going to double click my hand tool so it fits the picture to my screen. Let's see some other things that we can do with the crop tool. We get the crop tool. Instead of a 5x7, I want a 7x5. You just click these two little arrows to switch it. Now your width is 7 inches and your height is 5 inches. 300 pixel resolution is great for print resolution. I'm going to drag out a crop. And again, it doesn't matter because it constrains it to a 7x5. It doesn't matter if it's this big or this big. You're going to get a 7 inch by 5 inch picture. I'm going to hit my enter key. And when I do a file, print, you're going to see that there is a 7x5. I'm going to cancel out of that. Double click my hand tool, and I'm going to do an edit step backwards just to undo that crop. Double click my hand tool again to fit my image to my work area. Activate my crop tool again, come up to the options, and this time eh, instead of 5x7, I want a 4x6. I'm going to double click 4x6, but up at the top you'll see my options here. Width is 4 inches, height is 6 inches. Ah, that's good. Go ahead and drag out 4 by 6 hit my enter key, and there it is, a 4 by 6 inch picture. Double click my hand tool to fit it to my screen, and just to prove it to you, I'll do a file print, check out the preview. There is a 4 by 6 Cancel out of that. So use those crop options so that you get a nice crop and a nice frameable image. Let me show you something that can happen, though. If you want to manually crop and you've, you've already used some of those uh, crop settings that have been placed in there for you, so I clicked on my crop tool and I want to manually crop. I can't do it. I can't manually crop. I'm going to have to hit my escape key. So I'm going to hit my escape key to cancel out of the crop operation. Now when I come to the top, the reason why I can't manually crop is because I have some settings in there. All I have to do is come over here and click the clear button. That clears out all those settings. Now I can get the crop tool and create a manual crop. So remember, if your crop is being constrained to a certain dimension and you can't set a manual crop size, it's probably because you had some dimensions in those crop options. And you'll have to reset that. I'm going to hit my escape key to cancel out of this crop operation. So that was a lot of crop.